ways to sneak up on a gamer here. So I'm going to run this way, actually, because she's going to be oblivious. She's going to run directly into my clutches. What's going on, everyone? Today we have some Skull Merchant gameplay. Got something that might interest you. <laughs> and for this video, we'll be testing out some of the changes Skull Merchant got and whether or not they're any good. She got a bunch of changes recently that will hopefully make her three genning less oppressive, but also make her chase a little bit stronger. There's honestly a lot of stuff that got changed, so I'll put a link to the patch notes in the description if you want to read it, because it's just too much things to say here in an intro. But we'll be testing out a few of her different add-ons, as well as trying to run a couple different builds, and more so focus on the chase aspect and not just setting up a three gen to camp out. So for this first match, we'll be running a build of Coup de Grasse to extend extend our basic attack distance after a gen's been completed, brutal strength to break things faster, jolt for a little bit of gen regression, and then pain res for a little bit more gen regression since we're not going to be just monitoring gens in general. We're going to see what it's going to be. I'll probably have a different build in the second game, but hopefully you guys will enjoy this. If you do, make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. Should be live on Twitch as this goes up at twitch.tv slash Tony if you want to come by, say what's up, and watch some DBD. And also remember to sub because we're trying to hit 50k, and once we do, I will do a full week of Dead by Daylight content for you guys to watch. So hopefully you guys will enjoy this. I'll talk to you in the first match. All right, we are on the Shattered Square, the Decimated Burgo. Uh, this is going to be an interesting map, I feel. Yeah, let me know in the comments what you think about the Skull Merchant changes. Did it make her better? Do you still hate her? Is she insufferable? All that good stuff. That's offense. Uh, we're trying out a build this time, trying to make use of that haste. So we have something that gives survivors hindered when they enter a drone. But then we also have the thing that gives us action speed and haste when we enter a drone. So I'm going to do this real quick. And then hopefully they get slowed, maybe. We're... Where are they, actually? Are they around here? Are they on the other side? Oh, oh, I see them now. Okay, okay. So we get a little haste here. We also have that action speed bonus, which is why I have Brutal Strength on. I think maybe it could be an interesting little take. He's fucking dead. Come on, run. Go run. Get out of here. Look, I'll be nice. Oh, we actually get vault speed bonus too. So I think I actually get a hit here on Nancy because of the hindered with that. That's actually huge. And the fact that we get this 2% haste after the drone or after we leave the drone zone. The drone zone. Welcome to the drone zone. All right. Oh, I was just going to use that as a way to potentially just get her um, to slow down through there. But yeah, she left the loop. That's fine with me. I'm going to leave these places. Yeah, where they where they go. Um, I want to recall this one. I don't know which gen they're on. Okay, so there's definitely some in here. Hello? Did you just... Yeah, you just say you just fell right in front of me. Is this a... What is this pallet spot? Let's go ahead and break this. A little brutal. We don't have the action effect right there because we didn't enter the active zone. I'm just trying to see how her chase feels in regards with the, uh, with the new setup and everything. All right, thank you. If you would like to run to Shaq, oh my gosh, what is this? Is that not, oh, is it not active? That's probably why. That drone is not active currently. Nice, we'll take that. Huge damage. Break it as well. Where did she run? I'm gonna, no, I was gonna activate. Dang. Oh, I can't activate it. I can't activate it. No. All right, no, that's fine. Oh. Oh, that was fast. Man, that break speed was fast. So strong and Okay, why don't you get over here right now, Yunjin? I'm gonna have to do some things to you. Hey, yo! I mean, respectfully, of course. Nice, huge. And then also we have this, so I'm gonna go and break it. That's a real quick break right there. Nice little bout. <laughs> oh! That was, the, that was the fastest fucking flashlight. Maybe she has background player. That very well could be true. That's kind of become a more popular perk, I'd say, recently. Yeah, going for those flashlight saves is crazy. Oh, this is not ideal. I don't know oh. what I'm doing! She just ran into me. Hopefully she's not here. Like if we had a full team of background players, I'd be <laughs> I'd be really scared. All right, we'll go ahead and throw this here. They got rid of our our drone in here, but they have the thing now. It used to be an add-on where basically you would, if you vault, where did I just go? Oh, if you vault a pallet with a claw trap on, it would it would end up breaking the pallet, and now that's just part of her base kit. Hello, Michaela. Let's go after Michaela. I don't think we've hooked her. And we have hooked the... We've hooked the Nancy. Oh, she's just gonna keep running. She's our rider. She's our track star. She... I'm just doing now. I don't know if she had dead hard. Whoever's in there is exposed. That's Nancy. Doesn't really matter because she's injured currently. Do I get a speed boost going in? Like, is this active? Ooh, okay, let's go. Let's go. I have the permanent haste, though. It's like having a little agitation because she's inside of my... Inside of my drone rage right now. Hello. You've made a mistake, ma'am. I don't know why you did that. Nod for head. Oh, man. Shit, I should have done that. I've lost my opportunity. So no head? Um, I'm going to also try my best to not really, like, monitor a 3-gen. 
Um, I think that that's not really like fun in my opinion. I don't like just sitting around gens, which I know is kind of like what she's good at. I feel like I'm definitely catching up to survivors faster, which feels nicer for chase mechanics. And then also just like applying, I don't know how much the hindered applies, like maybe probably like two or three percent because right now we have this we can break this real quick she probably runs inside oh nice play do you, you taking a hit nancy is that what we're doing all right we'll put one right there i don't think that's worth it yeah she's just gonna hold w thankfully we don't have this here anymore let's look and see if she has that hard no she doesn't okay can i do this without getting flashlight saved perhaps Maybe through the window she can get it. Nice. Okay. She was going to go for it. I tried to face the wall as much as possible there. Let's put her up on here. Can I also just say, this map still blows. I just don't like how it looks. It is not ideal, in my opinion. It looks like just it's just too orange. We can't keep throwing this one here, which like monitors the main area. Which is like super, super chill. So she got uh, effects of that right there for a little bit. And we're still faster. And then watch us break this. We have the effects lingering for 15 seconds. Some people have called me a lingerer, a lingonberry even. Hit this. Nice, Yunjin, thank you. And she's just gonna drop it because she's sitting right here. We'll get rid of this as well. Hello, hello. And as soon as they enter our active zone, look at this, massive. We got the haste status effect. She hits the vault actually. Oh, she ran this way, my bad. Okay, so we're gonna be really, really fast here. Yep, one more. Pretty much all of these freaking, <laughs> all of these Jeds, or Jeds, pallets are gone. With that you cannot. Interesting. All right, we'll break this again. I assume that the 15% stacks with Brutal Strength. If it doesn't, then I look like an idiot, but I guess we have options at both points then. Uh, they keep wanting to do this main gen. I think just keeping progress on it is fine. We're not just like trying to stick to a certain area. This is going to be annoying for them. Pain res is definitely getting gutted, so I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get my uses in when I can. I'm going to be real with you guys. Nice, we still get that hit. Uh, I'm gonna recall this one. Can I do this? Yeah, I can put a drone here. I will kick it. I have not kicked many, many gens, but I will kick that one. It sounded like this gen out here was also had progress on it. Hello, anyone home? No, no, no one home. Ooh, they are, they're in there. I'm gonna get rid of this boot actually. Someone's inside probably. Oh no, they got rid of it. Why would you get rid of my drone? But it's okay, I have another. Let's see the vault speed. Cause we have increased vault speed for that add out as well. It gives you a lot. It gives you increased speed by 2%, plus 15% to break actions and vaulting. Like, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that. And then now she's hindered. That's huge. We see Michaela's behind here, so what I'm going to do is back up here and then run towards her. Because I can catch up to her because we have the haste status effect. She definitely has background players, so that's something we need to look out for. Please try to CJ attack me. Oh, fuck. Oh, where are you going to go now? Where are you going to go now? Yeet. All right, this is fine. We'll pick her up. Hopefully the other flashlight person isn't nearby. They have gotten one gen. And on a map like this, that is not even that great for Joel value. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna say it personally. I honestly have a really good like Scorch hook spread. So I'm, I'll take that. Okay, what's this gen? We can't have a drone too close to the hook though. Let's activate that one real quick. And then I'll head over. Oh, hello, Yunjin. Don't do it, Yunjin. You have so much to, oh, oh my God. Oh my God, she's insane, she's insane. The spins are honestly in right now. Let's go through here, run around here. She's, yeah, she's kind of fuckered. My bad. Not really my bad, but like, my bad. Hopefully they can get the save on that person. I'll pick up instantly, give them the opportunity at least. I'm pretty sure this chick's dead. There you go. I'll even run away. You can go ahead and get the save, Michaela. We'll let you keep playing the game. We're not trying to be too, too campy or anything. All right. Nice. So far, honestly, with this build, it feels good. I'm not even, like, I don't know what everyone else thinks about the skull version, but like I'm kind of zooming, and they basically have no uh, pallets on the on the map. Yunjin basically threw all of them down. This is going actually splendiferous. That's not a word, but that's that's the emotion I'm feeling currently. Shall we hit another pain res for the road? Spare a little pain res, please. Are they deactivating the drone? Did you just deactivate my drone? Oh god, just like okay, they just went away because the hook. Duh. Let's go through here. Pop one more. Hop a molly, I'm sweating. Ooh. I think next game I want to try out the one that has like quicker into undetectable and I think it like increases undetectable. And then maybe the one that gives you like aura on survivors when they enter an active zone. That could be interesting. Okay, they boon somewhere. No progress. I think they're just trying to reset. Again, we kind of do have a, a three gen right now, but like it's not necessary to, to monitor gens at this point. That should slow her down, right? If she hits the active zone. 
Nice. So yeah, she's going to be slow right now. I also don't know how long it lasts for the uh, the active, like, hindered on them. Like, it's when they enter it, but I don't think it stays on forever. I don't I, I should probably read, like, the uh, the description. Maybe we'll let Chunky Nutter Butter go on and live, live another day. Hello. We'll just chase them and make sure that they can follow at a safe distance. I should have used my, like, drone more. Hey, I'm tracking. Where's Michaela at? Where's Michaela at? I found her. Scanning. Control. Manipulate scientific data. I found Michaela. I'm fine. I'm finding her. I found her. I found her. She's on She's on the map. She's located. She's located. She's located. Echolocation for the hatch. Let me let me test it. Beep, 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 boop, 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 beep, 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 beep. No, man. You're thinking of beep, boop, boop, bop, boop, boop, bop. I think this thing's broken. Michaela. 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 It's, 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 it's right here. Here, have a drone to go. Thank you. Take it easy, gamer. She'll be exposed in the underworld. All right, GG's. All right, here we are at the Pale Rose. We're trying out a different thing. Gotta make sure I'm recording and not an idiot. I am recording, but I am still an idiot. All right, we're gonna be trying out the Oblivious mixed with Aura reading on the survivors. So I think this could be kind of interesting, potentially. So I'm gonna actually throw, I'm gonna throw this here. And try to use it as a ways to sneak up on a gamer here. So I'm gonna run this way, actually, because she's gonna be oblivious. She's gonna run directly into my clutches! Ah, nice! Yeah, that's why I wanted to test out right there. It seemed pretty cool. All right. This is huge. This is... That's massive aura reading, to be honest with you. Holy crap, that is fantastic. I also swapped off Coup de Grasse because, well, I don't think I even got a chance to really use it last game, and I just put on a save, because save's pretty solid. And then also, I have the lethal pursuer to extend our aura reading. Like I said, I'm most I'm mostly going to be focused on like the chase potential of the skull merchant because that that's what I think is like more interesting rather than just trying to shut down the three gens. I'm sure she probably still has decent three gen prowess. Wow, that's Fair enough. Going in chase, I think, is going to be more fun. I also brought that out a little bit too much. I don't know if, like, people... Uh, <laughs> I didn't realize... It's like, you have to wait for the animation to finish. And, like, as you, like, go backwards, it will deploy it in a weird spot. We should be able to get a hit here on Claudette. Nope, we won't get a hit here on Claudette. Oh, my gosh. We should get a hit here on her because she has the... Uh, we have Bloodlust and she ran into a tree. Nice. Let's just keep running around this. If she hits into the into the main building, I would normally... If I had the speed add-on with the drone here, this would be huge. Nice. We'll break this. She's going to run this way. We might be able to use the Oblivious status effect on this. Okay. No, she's going to run away. All right. And then we just use this. Nice. She has Sprint Burst, so we know she doesn't have Dead Heart. And she's Edge Mapping. That's a little cringe if you ask me, Claudette. Going to the edge of the map, there's nothing there. Look it, it's literally boxed in. We should be able to make it to this uh, Scourge Hook that is right by Shack, which is pretty nice. I'm a big fan of that, big fan of that. Also, this is another map that has like a good little bit of value that you can have for main. Okay, so this is the most worked on one. I'm gonna actually just throw a drone here. Ah, yeah, there we go. Was that another sprint first? That was another sprint first. Okay, uh, sure, fair enough. Gamer, what are you doing, Meg? What are you doing? That should be activated. Oh, she's killing herself. <gasps> okay, I guess we're going after her now. Not that this matters. We can literally track her, right, with a claw trap. But now we have just the aura reading on it as well. Nice. Okay, that's life, it would appear. I can literally see her at all points of the game. Information is on my side. This is just, I don't know what the point of this is. Oh, the claw trap right there. That's massive. She's gonna fall off. Oh, it hers broke. Okay. Okay. For a second I thought the claw trap stays on, but I forgot the battery doesn't reset when you enter into the zone. Where's she at? She's down here. Cool. I don't know if they actually had themselves say a flashlight on this team. But no, this is pretty big value so far. Not having to worry about really uh just in general monitoring gens has been nice. They've gotten one gen done though. Okay, we're looking over here. Okay, ooh. Also drones on here seem pretty good, right? Or are they just outside the active range there? She was just outside the active range there. All right, she's going way, way edge map. I don't know what you're doing, ma'am. Do you have a Pogus Logus here? You do, but you're doing something. All right. We take that. Nice. Okay, Claudette is our obsession. We need to remember that. And then I'm just gonna... I'd like to throw in here. She drops. Oh, I got her though. Huge. Okay. That was massive. I didn't think I was going to get her there. I was. She was just outside my uh, drone range. We get her. We have another score chuck to our left. This is... Did you always just go pretty fine? All right. That's fine. I respect you for that, Vittorio. He's got a little tool, tool be on him. 
That's a free hit. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is becoming massive. We're going to see his aura for a very long time. Nice. Could track him super easily. Like, I feel like her drone chasing isn't even bad. Am I... Am I weird for that? Is... Do, do people still think that it's shit? All right. Where did we do gens at? We're somewhere over here. Just trying to see if they get... I get notified. No, I did not. Let's activate that. Don't know if anyone's sitting in there. Okay, no. It looks like they're over here. Yeah, they're definitely in there. I'm gonna activate that real quick. Did she jump off again? She's waiting. Oh my gosh, she's a waiter. I only have the chicken farmies. Yeah, yeah. Where's my drink? My diet doctor kelp. Get back here. They actually have a lot of toolboxes. Oh, um, that's awkward. We're pretty much. I mean, we are max save the best for last stacks right now. So that's huge. Huge for the program. She, she runs into this. We get her down because we know she has. Again, she has the uh, sprint burst. Man, I'm I'm like actually not doing too bad. She's still kind of boring with her power at the end of the day. It's not like my style, you know. I like the ones that go fast. I like Blight. I like Weska. Like Simone in my life. But you know, at least you have some chase options, right? Nice. Oh no, Jill, you are in a not fantastic spot. Nah, use that aura is insane. Wow, we do this, we throw it up here. I think Vittorio's going in for the save. I'm gonna activate this one. If Vittorio went in for the save, I'm gonna actually go after him because I don't think I've even chased him yet. No, I did chase him, I did down him. Never mind, yeah, I've downed him. But I believe he is first hook, whereas Claudette's death and so is Meg. Again, just using this uh, Oblivious right here, plus this extra time we're gonna see him on the... On the radar? Oh, where do you think you're going, sir? I can't let you get close. Nice, he's running around the outside, around the outside. Vittorio, that toolbox better have a fucking shotgun in it or something. Alright, that's pretty massive. Our Scorch Hook like layout isn't too bad. Honestly, we could have like three gen around Shaq and kept like those score checks like keep going monitoring them but no this is fine use my jolt use the pain res to get the value from it dude the new, the new pain res is gonna be like so cheeks it's gonna be absolutely terrible all right we have that one active right now we're just listening perhaps someone was over here nope this is still regressing it looks like so i guess i kind of have drones set up on gens Duh. I thought there was a wraith appearing in front of me i saw someone running actually through here to the back so i'm gonna go after them where did they go oh it's Vittorio. Hi, Vittorio. Goodbye, Vittorio. It's been nice knowing you. It really has. I take it now this freaking Claudette is just going to be chilling. Nope. Never mind. She's not chilling. I... I don't know what the point of that was. She's frankly just given up on life, it would appear. Respectfully speaking. Okay. Meg is healed up. Not exactly sure where. She hasn't ran into any zones yet. I mean, because they're not active, but I'm going to activate that one real quick. Mm, maybe throw one here. I'm trying to at least figure out where she's at. Did they take an add-on? No, I'm just going to check inside main because that's where it likes to spawn quite a lot. It, in fact, did not spawn in main. I'm going to activate that as well in case she comes over. Comes over to play. I got a, I got a sick fucking big wheel that we can ride around in, in, in the lawn and stuff. I also, my dad said he's going to grow hamburgers and we got... Uh, we even got cheese to put on them, so, like, if she wants to come over and, and hang out, that's just cool. Uh, she didn't want him, like, maybe she's a vegan? I don't know. All right, everybody, that's gonna do it for the video. I hope you did enjoy. Honestly, I feel, yeah, I mean, she she feels better, but I still think that her three gening is probably still quite strong, and that's probably how most people are still gonna play her, but I liked this, the add-ons right here of uh because the people actually in the after game screen uh i don't usually record that but they were typing they're like how fast i was and they, they, they thought like i had like play with your food or something because i was catching up to them so quickly but yeah uh i didn't realize in the game i thought it was only like a three percent i got the numbers mixed up but it's a uh five percent hinder which is more than compound 33 on blight but a little bit less than like wesker uh fully infected hindered which is eight so you catch up pretty quickly plus having the uh 2% speed bonus from ending, uh entering a drone and then also on her power uh you get a speed boost right for when i don't know what how much it is i think it's like is it 4% for when the first one survivor enters so 
You stack that on top of that, and then you get the double speed, and then it lingers after, and you can break things fast. So you, they pretty much lose a lot of distance, and you're constantly able to gain on them. So you can use your drones around loops, which seems, you know, like a pretty decent idea. Uh, I still think that she probably needs a little bit of work as a killer in general. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for the support, and I will talk to you in the next one. Peace.